Happy birthday to hip hop artist and actor Nelly. And happy birthday to the late great legendary prodigy from the infamous Mob Deep. X-Men 1991 back again with another sports topic. This is the only rant that I'm going to be doing today because it's late. So let's go ahead and do a recap of last night's game between the defending champs, the Golden State Warriors, and the Miami Heat. The Heat won by nine in the first quarter, 33 to 24. But they lost by seven in the second quarter, 32 to 25. It was Heat 58, Warriors 56 at halftime. Heat lost by 10 in the third quarter, 38 to 28. It was Warriors 92, Heat 86 in the third quarter, after the third quarter. Heat won by 15 in the fourth quarter, 30 to 15. Final score. Miami Heat 116. Golden State Warriors 109. Both teams are now 3 and 5. Before I get into that, I'm not going to do it. This is a quick reminder that the Heat are now 4 and 5. They just beat the Sacramento Kings tonight 110 to 107. Friday, they go against the Pacers. Monday, the day before Election Day, taking on the Trailblazers. Next Thursday, taking on the Hornets. Next Saturday, taking on the Hornets again. Jimmy Butler, 23 points. Six rebounds, eight assists. Bam Adebayo, 19.7 rebounds, six assists. Kyle Lowry, 13 points, five rebounds, nine assists. Caleb Martin, five points, four rebounds, no assists. And Tyler Hero, two points, one rebound, one assist. For the bench, they get 54 points. Max Struss, 24 points, 1 rebound, 2 assists. Gabe Vincent, 4 points, 8 rebounds, 3 assists. Duncan Robinson, 17 points, 2 rebounds, 3 assists. And Dwayne Dedman, 9 points, 5 rebounds, no assists. Steph Curry, 23 points, 13 rebounds, 13 assists. Andrew Wiggins, 24 points, 5 rebounds, 4 rebounds, 5 assists. Clay Thompson, 19 points, 3 rebounds, 2 assists. Draymond Green, 5 points, 6 rebounds, 3 assists. And Kevin Looney, 4 points, 3 rebounds, 2 assists. For the bench, they get 37 points. Jordan Poole, 9 points, 2 rebounds, 2 assists. Gemma Cal Green, 9 points, 9 rebounds, 1 assist. Moses Moody, 6 points, no rebounds, 2 assists. Ty Jerome, 8 points, 1 rebound, 1 assist. And James Wiseman, five points, no rebounds, no assists. The player of the game was not Jimmy Butler. It was Max Struss with 24 points, one rebound, and two assists. Steph Curry got a triple-double, 23 points, 13 rebounds, and 13 assists. But the player of the game belongs to Max Struss.
Now let's talk about Halloween's game between the Houston Rockets and the LA Clippers. Rockets lost by was seven. Rockets lost by seven in the first quarter, thirty to twenty-three. But they made a comeback, outscoring the Clippers by eight, twenty-nine to twenty-one in the second quarter. At halftime. Clippers 51, Rockets 42. Rockets outscored the Clippers by Deuce in the third quarter, 24 to 22. After three, Clippers 73, Rockets. 40, uh, 66. Rockets lost by five in the fourth quarter, 22 to 17. Final score, Los Angeles Clippers 95, Houston Rockets 93. The Clippers were three and four as the Rockets fell one and seven. And they lost to the Clippers again tonight. 109 to 101. The Rockets now fall to 1 and 8 as the Clippers are now 4 and 4. Saturday, the Rockets go up against the Timberwolves before they go against the Magic on Monday. Next Wednesday, against the Raptors. Next Saturday, against the Pelicans. The 14th, a rematch taken on the Clippers. Paul George, nine point thirty five points, nine rebounds, eight assists. Ivisa Zubak, sixteen points, twelve rebounds, no assists. Marcus Morris Jr. Senior, eleven points, three rebounds, three assists. Luke Kennard, ten points. 8 points, 10 rebounds, 2 assists. And Reggie Jackson, 6 points, 2 rebounds, 6 assists. For the bench, they get 19 points. Norman Powell, 9 points, 1 rebound, no assists. Nicholas Batum, 2 points, 3 rebounds, 3 assists. Terrence Mann, 4 points, 1 rebound, 1 assist. Amir Coffey, three points, three rebounds, no assists. And Brandon Boston Jr., 1.2 rebounds, no assists. Alperin Sangoon. 14 points, 9 rebounds, 3 assists. Kevin Porter Jr., 13 points, 5 rebounds, 5 assists. Jalen Green, 13 points, 4 rebounds, 1 assists. Eric Gordon, 12 points, 2 rebounds, 2 assists. And Jabari Smith Jr., 4 points, 5 rebounds, 1 assist. For the bench, they get 37 points. Kenyon Martin Jr., 23 points, 6 rebounds, 1 assist. Garrison Matthews, 3 points, 2 rebounds, no assist. Tari Eason, 6 points, 1 rebound, no assist. Usman Garuba, 2 points, 8 rebounds, 1 assist. Deshian Mix, Knicks, 
Three points, two rebounds, two assists. And Josh Christopher, no points, no rebounds, one assist. Of course, Paul George was the player of the game with 35 points, nine rebounds, and eight assists. Ivisa Zubak only needed 10 assists to go with a triple-double, but the player of the game belongs to Paul George. First things first, I want to say congratulations to the Miami Heat for beating the Warriors and for beating the Kings tonight. As for the Rockets, what the hell is going on with you guys? You've lost eight in a row now. Well, not in a row, but still, you lost eight games. You're the last seed in the Western Conference. You got swept by the Clippers, but I give them credit because they came to play. I don't know. The Rockets doesn't win, start winning games. I'm also not watching them for the rest of the season. This is getting terrible. I know it's early, but come on, Rockets. You got to do better than this shit. Just keep your ass up. Get your shit together. Get yourselves ready for Friday. I don't know what to do. Oh, no. They don't have a game until Saturday, so they can rest for the next two days until Saturday. But that's going to wrap up my rant of a recap between the Golden State Warriors and the Miami Heat and the Houston Rockets and the LA Clippers. If you're new here, hit subscribe if you like the content and hit that notification bell for my next Heat and Rockets rant. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up. Leave your comment down below. I will catch you tomorrow. Reminisce in 19 years of Goldberg saving Stone Cold Steve Austin from Batista from the November 3rd, 2003 edition of Monday Night Raw. Don't follow your dreams. Chase them. Peace. Go Miami Heat. And as always, go Houston Rockets.